You gotta get the unibrow. Right there. What's up guys? Clark from ClarkDanger.com. This week on the weekly Wednesday Health Hack, we're talking about turmeric. There's been over 600 um, attributed benefits to this stuff. So for the sake of the video, I'll go over a couple and then I'll show you how to use it. One of the biggest uses of turmeric is uh, the anti-inflammatory properties. Now this is really important because inflammation in your body can lead to all sorts of problems. Arthritis, brain fog, inflammation of the brain, poor circulation of your blood. The anti-inflammatory properties are so strong in this, it's kind of been called nature's ibuprofen. A lot of endurance athletes are grabbing on to turmeric and using it for that. I know a buddy in the sauna I talked to who swears by it and he's on the uh, stair climber for three hours just dripping sweat. At the end of it, it looks like he went swimming. Detoxification. Detox is kind of a catch-all word, but uh, turmeric has been shown to boost antioxidants like glutathione uh, in your liver that can help with cell function. Curcumin has the most backed research around cancer. For legal reasons, I'm not gonna touch that topic with a 10 foot pole, but really cool stuff if you wanna look into that. The last one, some research coming out now that shows curcumin may be a good antidepressant. It has antidepressant properties. All right guys, just leaving the Whole Foods got the turmeric, we're gonna go make the stuff. Let's go. Probably the most simple way is raw. You can just literally take a bite out of this stuff. It tastes a little bit like a radish and a carrot mixed together with a kick of ginger. Really good. Or you can juice it and do turmeric juice shots. The second way is actually to make a juice cocktail. I like to use turmeric, about six large carrots, couple stalks of celery, half a cucumber, and some lemon. Here's a tip. When you're consuming turmeric, you want to use lime, black pepper, and some sort of fat. The reason you do this is because a lot of the, the properties of curcumin are fat soluble, which means to get into your body or your cell membranes, they need a fat to carry them. Tea time. The next little recipe here is called golden milk. Now this comes from, uh, I believe it's India, and it's actually really good. It's a really cool warm drink that doesn't taste too bad. Kind of tastes like a curry broth, like a coconut curry broth if you go to a Thai restaurant or something. Um, so here's how you make it. You do a full cup of coconut milk, one teaspoon of turmeric, either powdered, but fresh is better. You can grate it in if you want. Half a teaspoon of cinnamon, little bit of black pepper. You can either sweeten this with honey, stevia, or whatever else you have in your kitchen. Drink that up and it's a great way to incorporate turmeric into your everyday. Now let's get into some external uses for turmeric. All right, it's beauty school with Clark. The things I do for you. Uh, today we got the turmeric face mask. So we got our paste right here. Get a glass bowl. Now this is important because it will stain ceramic. One teaspoon of turmeric, some raw honey in there, probably two teaspoons, a squeeze of lime, and then I put some avocado oil, although you can use olive oil or coconut oil as well. Mix that all together so it's somewhat of a thick paste. You want it to be a little bit thick. And so you just apply some on your brush right here. Now we apply. Once that's all good, start spreading it on your face. Do it evenly, and then you wanna let it sit for 20 minutes before rinsing it off with warm water. What do you think, is this a good look? Am I beautiful yet? Of course your face starts itching right when this stuff gets on. Oh my God. So far so good, tastes kinda of sweet. I'm excited to see it. I like to get paper towels because this stuff will stain. To make a DIY tooth whitening toothpaste, what you do is you get two tablespoons of coconut oil. If you wanna warm it up before to make it easier to apply, you can. You get one tablespoon of turmeric and then six drops of whatever essential oil you prefer. 
lavender works great, sage is good. I'm using tea tree right here because I can't get enough of tea tree. Mix it all up, put it on your toothpaste and get brushing. This thing really puts the tooth in, no, the paste in toothpaste, doesn't it? I messed that up. I'm so mad, this is one of my favorite shirts and uh, I'm gonna have to get a new one. My girlfriend's gonna kill me, she got this for me. This is a fine way, although the bioavailability of a lot of supplements, meaning the amount that you actually absorb, is somewhere around 10%. So I'm not sure with turmeric since it's probably powdered in rice capsules. So I'll post a link down below, an Amazon affiliate link, uh, how you can support the show. And I'll post it to the powder I use, the turmeric powder, a supplement that I use and then uh, I can't really do the raw form. All right, that's it guys. If you like this video, please thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't down below for the every single week. We go over a new health hack to make you healthy, happy, inspired. All right, I'm Clark from ClarkDanger.com. Stop settling, start living. I'll see you next week.